All right, hello everybody. This is Demon coming back for the other round of the fun, exciting, controversial, influential. Blah, blah, blah. Influential. I like speaking English. English is my first language. Um, safe working conditions. Absolutely, no problem, brother. Did Hungary just gain into? Oh, look at that Hungary! Look at her in her glory. Wow, that is a huge ass Hungary. I thought Hungary only took up to. I didn't think they got Croatia. I did not think Hungary got access to all of freaking Croatia almost. Jesus. So that stuff's in. Um, I go for a deep defense system next. That's what I would say, do. Alright, any other territories I gotta be concerned with? I do feel a powerful sneeze about to kick in. Ah, burns. Okay, that stuff's good. Those ports are still upgrading, man. I am a happy camper right now. Oh yeah, I forgot. You guys were still finishing, so I have to actually upgrade you still. Benin, Worry. You actually need a full upgrade. I'm fine with leaving the forts where they are now. Level 1, level 2 is across Africa. It's not the best, but in my personal opinion, it's good enough. I'm not looking to have all of this. I will guard Somaliland a little bit more, though. <laughs> um, the other thing is Marcus Island. How are you doing? Oh, good. You're finally getting your resources in. Infantry troop just got finished. That means we can... Go here. And Corsica. That isn't this, is it? No, it's just Corsica. Okay, I didn't know if they, they came up with a creative name thinking they're going to, like, come up with this funny name to add to that. And then I suddenly look and it goes, This territory is built in Corsica. I'll get enraged. <laughs> Alright, so the ports are pretty much guarded. Well, most of the naval landing areas are guarded. That's actually really nice. Oh yeah, I forgot I was upgrading you as well into that freaking bunch. Border provinces are guarded. Run needs an upgrade. We'll have deep defense system before the war starts, so... As I said, if, um... The... Germans decide they want in this war for Bavaria's Rhineland. I mean, bring it on, bitch. I got all day. By the time reinforcements arrive, I already have them conquered here. Actually, now I know which ones you guys are. Head in. The Germans did not arrive. That means they gave up. Good. That means they're not going to help their friends. Alright, that stuff's all good. Let's go ahead and go for the combustion engine. And send in reinforcements. Gone in an instant. Excellent. Alright, war's over. I'll probably just wait for this to get done before I start upgrading these things. Um, I'm fine with militancy losses. The only area that we'll get full upgrade right now is, um, Paris. <coughs> God, what the hell was that? Is that a burning sensation go down my throat? Oh, God, I didn't even drink anything. 62. I mean, I'm just gonna sit on here, so... Bavaria, you have two options. It's either attack me and try to take it, or let me sit here and I still take it. <laughs> Economy is doing a hell of a lot better, though, bruh. And build... How many of these can we build? I can only build one. Excellent. We'll build another one in Brest. An artistic genius. Excellent. Alright, I can build one more army in preparation. Uh, you gentlemen can head to Lyon. 
if that's Leon. Leon. I don't know where that's at. And we'll go up here next. They'd accept that, but they won't let me get it yet. Alright, I'm just going to sit on territory. I could really care less. Actually, you know what? One thing I could do. Do it, you dumb bastards. Give military access real quick. Do it. Do it. I know you have troops. Just march across. Try to secure it. Come on. You know what you want to do. Do it, AI. Okay, screw you. I'll just, you. I'll just keep troops on it then. I mean, we'll get the war eventually. I don't really care. We won't get as much infamy down, but... Eh. And then... Who's allied with the Netherlands? I don't think Spain has the balls to go to war with me. I mean, I could probably go after Belgium, to be honest. Okay, those troops finished. Get back here, get you. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Excellent. One of the last French troops we're building in Europe. For assembly line. In terms of migrations, how are our migrations looking? Um, I mean, we're not the worst. Only like 700 people are trying to leave France, and we are upgrading our, um laws and everything. It's probably because we're at war. A lot of people aren't happy right now. I see a lot of people leaving Hungary and Italy though. Jesus Christ. Head down here, kill that, and then head home. Alright, that secured that. That cut back my migrations by any because we're we finished the war. Not really. Bavaria, you want peace yet? No, you do not. I mean, they'll get to a point where they're going to accept it. Oh, yeah, the one thing I forgot to check. How many oil provinces do we have right now? I know I've seen one come up earlier. So, Dubai is one. None there. None there, none there. Brunei is the other. Excellent, so we have two oil-producing provinces. And nobody took Etcha yet. I feel like I should go after them. <laughs> Let's say I want to do a war goal against Belgium. What would I have? I could make them a puppet. Make them a puppet, then go to war with the Netherlands and free uh, their last area. Do something similar to them, too. Hmm. Tough call. Well, I know all my Africa territories territory is held together, so I'm good on that. I probably will start building some Africa cores. To have a meetup in Algiers or something and start sending them in. Alright, what do you idiots want next? Okay, I'm paying for unemployment subsidies. Oh, we can do low just because I can't guarantee all you workers are going to be in there. That's the one thing I can't guarantee. I can't guarantee I'll have enough jobs out so people can work. Alright, you're still doing your thing. You guys are fine over me. Fine here, fine here. I guess the two places, a couple places we could go for, or our northern hemisphere, or western hemisphere territories. Those can all get upgraded now. Oh yeah, I forgot a Madagascar. Jesus Christ. Upgrade Jens. You're already upgrading. Upgrade you. You guys are still upgrading. Go here, do them. Also do go ahead and do these guys too. Oh, did we lose that did we lose a flight? What did we lose? Oh. I didn't realize they attacked us. Alright, send reinforcements in, we're killing them. So we have reinforcements in the rear. I actually didn't think they'd have the balls to attack me. Alright. 
Those guys are going to push in down here. I want reinforcements here, 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 and here. You guys are just going to overwhelm it with a wave attack. Yeah, you're not reinforcing this any further. Alright, I need you, you, and you to head here. I need you gentlemen to head back up here. You're just going to get out of the actual fight. I don't want you guys fighting right now. You guys will go ahead and switch locations. You're going to head south. And with that, Bavaria accepts peace. So let's go ahead and move our troops around real quick. And that's what I thought. Alright, gentlemen, you can head back down to Monte Pilar. Alright, upgrade the Rhineland. Upgrade Alsace Lorraine. Do border provinces. Some person would probably be like, Demon, just control click. Yeah, but I don't want to upgrade all the forts. I only want to, I only want to upgrade the frontline forts. I don't care about the rest. They can burn. That one's still upgrading over there. It is. It is. It's only the border provinces that I care about. Alright, that's enough for them. Um, Since we lost an army, I assume I can build a brand new one. Yep, called it. Uh, you guys over here, go ahead and head in, you'll reinforce that line. And then I think we're going to war for, um, our boys up there. should get the resources fast. Well, now it's also building all those forts up, so it's going to be hard for it to get everything. Okay, you guys got your infantry done. Back down. That's the replacement army we're going to get. And in terms of getting ready, yeah, these guys should be fine. Advanced metallurgy, that will increase production. And for experimental psychology to give us an additional boost. In terms of getting reinforcements and more experience for the units. Alright, there we go. The battleships are all building. And we have our callus ally to make them a puppet. Alright. I'm going to do real quick is end that. We're going to declare war. Britain, you want in? She wants in. Move the lines around a little bit. And that is what I thought you would do, you dumb bastard. So, head up here. No, head here. Head here. You and you are going to head there. You and you were going to go there. With that, the British are out of the war. <laughs> That's such a dick. 
All right, the royalists are in charge. What do you guys believe in? You, you, you didn't mess my economy up, did you? Oh, you guys are fine. I like you. Oh, I can resubsidize all the factories. <sighs> oh, how much I want to do that. And how much I will do that. Got fleet in here. Gentlemen, I didn't kill them. Head here. Head here. Combined into one super fleet. so far I'm happy man I say let's keep pushing I can get more reinforcements across the strait yep there's the fight go ahead and abandon that territory we took we're gonna hold them here hit them here This army should be fine. Go ahead and reinforce them. And you guys are going to head back to Dunkirk. And then are you connected to anything? You are. Alright, I can't thin this line out much more. Uh, we'll take two armies from down in the south. And you guys are going to head there in the Salisbury. Go. Gentlemen, it's been fine working with you. <laughs> Kill them all. I'm actually not going to lie. I might actually just go ahead and see if, like, how much does the puppet cost how much is it 185 I might destroy Britain with this war don't do it Britain I have reinforcements on the other side I always have reinforcements first fleet I don't uh, we're going to go ahead and do management strategy. Assert our position. I need reinforcements for these boys. That's enough. Alright, I want you guys to head up here too. You're going to reinforce them. These are freshly built troops. Gentlemen, head back. Kill that. Send the injured troops back across the channel. They'll head home. You guys can head down to Plymouth. Alright, gentlemen, head in. Kill them all. They're hitting us in two spots. Go ahead and reinforce. You guys will just add troops to the count. Kill them up here. That'll give us the victory here. The British will lose that fight up there. Um, head up here. And then head here. Here to the Battle of London. Send more troops in. It's a meat grinder right now. Send all the troops in. Send every available troop into that fight. Alright, if you want to keep going, let's keep going, boy. We got all day, bruh. All day, bruh. And I know you don't have the troop count to keep doing this, so. Gone. It'll kill you a lot sooner than it'll kill me. Alright. You guys did your job. Head here. 
The other one, head here. That secures all of Belgium's territory. Head here, boys. Head up here. Do your maneuvers. All right. Britain, you willing to accept peace? Not yet. They want to fight. All right, let's fight. Head south, corner him, corner him. I mean, they're going to keep losing troops no matter what, so I don't even know why they're even trying to fight this any further. I'd already gave them the DL. That's actually kind of funny. I stopped him. Kill him now. Head here, boys. Head here, boys. Neoclassical theory to get additional boosts. Head up here. Uh, we'll send three armies over Mia. And rest of you head in here. And since we're defending, it's an easy win. Head here. Head Flemish gentlemen. Send in reinforcements for these boys. They need help. Nothing to do with you, Manchuria. You good luck. Up here, gentlemen. Head here to Cambridge. This is going to destroy the British. I don't even know why they want to keep fighting this. Head back to London. Alright, boys. You're going to head here. And I want to send reinforcements into them. I mean, they're done. Their whole army is gone. What's Africa look like? It's probably a goddamn mess, isn't it? Yep, they're going through siege and territory, acting like they're getting the great game on. I've taken all your factories. All of them, almost. You're not going to win. You have no resources. Lincoln. I want all of you to go here. Kill them there. Kill another portion of the British army. Head up here. And then immediately send three more armies in. Gone in an instant. So like I said, they can have all they want of the other territories. If you don't own your mainland, then there's no point in you playing. You're out. The war is over. Kill them again. This was me, I already accepted the L. So I said the AI always death war themselves. It's so boring. Because what's gonna happen as a result of me winning this entire conflict is Britain will burn for a very long time. And I do mean burn. It will burn. I would not be surprised if Ireland or um Scotland gain independence because they're just gonna fight for in the in the end. And I know they'll get it. Go for administration efficiency, I guess. Want to accept peace? They're still going strong. Alrighty, boy. You want to keep fighting? I'll fight you to the end. Alright. But before we do that, I need all of you guys to start heading back down south to guard the border again. Just in case. Just in the south. The north will be fine. Head to Edinburgh, head to Glasgow, 
You guys are going to go over to the Irish territories now. I want that too. Just hit it all. Go to Dublin. No, 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 no. I wanted peace a while ago. You're the one that wanted to keep fighting this. Now you're fighting until the end. Remember that time where I was like, hey, dog, you want peace? I'm, I've already taken London. You went, no, I'm good. I'm going to keep fighting. Now I'm death warring you. This will probably destroy the British for a while. That's actually the funny thing. If Britain doesn't recover from this, I'll probably just take the rest of Europe under my freaking lineage. Or exhaustion's high. Excellent. Yep, there's the first rebels. Kill them. Head here. Head there. Head there. And then you guys head to Cork. And this is what a full siege looks like in Britain. What's our war exhaustion at? 36%. How fast is it going up? I would love to know. Oh, Sutton just died. What died? I think the app I use for all my Corsair stuff died for a second. Hopefully that doesn't turn my headset off. No, I don't see the red. I don't see a red line on it. So the headset's up. National banking. Ah, uh, we have almost all the techs. I say let's go for psychoanalysis and go back to navy. Get high seas battle fleet. We're ready to go, man. All right, all of Britain is sieged. She is now at forty-one percent. All right, you guys are gonna head here. Here. Here, 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 and here. All right, that's the whole French army. She's out. French fleet can head back down to Brest. And I want a little bit higher. I want it to be a little bit higher. I want around 50%. What do my people want? Unemployment subsidies again? How about I give you acceptable uh, work conditions? We all accept that. You get 50%, you're 51. That's exactly where I want it to be. Good, 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 good that the British are completely destroyed and if none of their armies in Britain then it suffers massive rebellions it will never recover oh god the Russians are going for West Galicia or, wait East Galicia wait what they did say West or East because if it said East Galicia I'm kind of concerned Because that, that is going to be a border gory looking piece of junk. Ugh. And most of my troops are fine. I don't think we suffered too... We didn't suffer, I think, too many casualties in that war. Overall, that was a good war for France. Um, like, we suffered almost none. I mean, there were casualties, but... Overall, I would dare say the British suffered the worst, and I'm pretty sure they mobilized, so I killed off a huge portion of their population when they did that to me. Alright, go ahead and guard the southern border. So, this one, this one, this that's already upgrading. That one's already upgrading. You guys are good. This one needs upgraded. Okay. Let's go ahead and do this. It's all important to me. Go over Mia. Upgrade this. Any port areas, we will upgrade. Also guard Liberia. 
So I said, I think this delayed Britain by a lot, because they put more troops down here than they did in their home islands. So I said, the AI is very stupid. Like, let's say I didn't, like, let's say I didn't even guard my port. Like, let's put it in that perspective. And they just tried sending large sums of troops at me, right? Either way, I still win. <laughs> because the AI won't have enough troops to fight me anyway. Because it'll lack the, um... It'll lack the naval weapon... Well, not naval weaponry, but it'll lack the actual good troops to fight. It'll be fighting a war with a bunch of peasants. So if it mobilizes and sends a whole bunch of troops here, all I gotta do is send two reinforcement armies. Bam, war's over. Uh, who's friends with you, by the way? You're protected by Britain as well, and I don't see Britain wanting to go to war anytime soon with high war exhaustion. Um, you guys want more unemployment subsidies? Fine, we'll extend the subsidies. We're like the United States. Um, I'm fine with excellent. I'm fine with excellent work conditions. That's really good. Okay, we just got that. Any new text besides High Seas Battle Fleet? That is it. Alright. Okay, I would dare say that our next focus... The real question is, is would, would Spain join that with them? If they did, that would make things a very difficult fight. I don't think they would, because they are in my sphere. I don't think they'd have the balls to do it. I've been keeping Spain going, man. They owe me a lot. Head over here, kill them, and then head home, boys. Who's North Germans allied with? That's killable. Go ahead, Portugal. Uh, we'll build up the rest of Spain. I want their mainland to be really good. Alright, that upgrades their mainland. They're set to go, man. Oh yeah, and upgrade this too, because I think that connects to us in a way. <laughs> yeah, it connects down to the south. That's good. Go ahead and expand the fort on Suez. You must have got attacked during the war, so... Probably explains why you're like that. I assume you guys might have got hit too. That was Marcus Island. Upgradable. Do so. I assume you must have got attacked at some point. You didn't. You didn't. I assume you two must have, because I know I built the forts up there, I think. really just don't know where else to go. I, I, I have a feeling to go after Netherlands. My only concern is if Spain joins on Netherlands' side. If they did, I'd no longer have a full border guard. Well, no, I don't actually have to guard it because what's-her-face isn't involved. It really comes down to do I think I have enough troops to fight an unholy war against everybody. And that's really what it comes down to, and I don't know if I do or not. I don't think I have enough. I got the balls on me to fight it. But I don't know if I have troops for it. It'd be a costly fight, man. If everybody's curious, I mean, just an all-out war between me and all the AI. I'm in freaking Europe, so I know a lot of people come after me. How about... We wait until gas attack. We'll do that again. We'll do another gas attack thing. If I have enough after gas attack and I can win, I'll go all out against the AI. I'll take all, I'll fight England to the ground. I'll take all the southern, I'll take Ireland, I'll take uh, Scotland, I'll even release them afterwards. We'll do it that way. Did I upgrade you guys? I did. Just gotta get this side. Side, this one. This one. Good. The fleet power grows. 
More battleships, that's all I want. You're already upgrading, you're not upgrading, so do you, do you. Aidens is upgrading already to the other. Do I not have any money? Oh god, I don't have money. That's a, that's a new one, I've never not had money. Uh, yours is already upgrading. So we got level 5 forts now. Ports. I need a lot more money, Jesus Christ. How about we just tax the poor at 100% for a while? <laughs> Easiest way to get money real quickly, just tax the poor, get the money in, then lower it again. It's really nice. What it will do, though, is it will kind of dilute my population a little bit for a while, because some people are probably going to go and try to become middle class and the rich at this point, so they can get out of this tax bracket. So in the end, it does work in my favor to have done this. Alright. Let the economy fix itself. Let's get at least a minimum of 500,000, and then we'll lower the taxes down to zero again. Okay, it's 1898, no army tech, no navy tech, no commerce, no culture, but there is integral uh, railway systems. Alright. Alright, we're good. Lower their taxes again. Spain is having an unruly people. Jesus Christ. Kill them all. My army just marches through. It's just... <laughs> It's like Warhammer 40k. Boom. Boom. It took a rail network. It's gonna be nice though, man. Getting that thing. Everything in uh, France will be set up, ready to go. Everything in our outlying territories, ready to go. For some reason, this thing is done. We try to upgrade that. I'm not doing everything for them. That's where I stop. Um, uh, we will do that because that's uh, that's on that. I will have Venezuela out a lot more though. I want them going. They have oil. Good. Oh yeah, we were building a new army. I forgot about that. Um, Strasbourg. Here, 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 here. Here, 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 here. Excellent. The trips are getting done. Alright. Trying to think about where else to go. I'm thinking maybe go after North Germans, but 176 to my 240 almost. Britain's in collapse. I know they're collapsing. Even if I know they, even if I'm not seeing it happen, I know something's happening. At war exhaustion, they have to be suffering over there. I like penal colonies. I mean, I see India breaking apart more. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I feel like there's more states added into this. What the hell is this? What is this? Oh my god, they didn't get control of freaking Vladivostok yet? Russia, what are you doing? You're disgusting. What the hell is this? Austrian communists have secured East Galicia. Why? Protectionism to the max. Protectionism to the max. Oh, how much I want to do it. And I can't. I don't want to take the risk to lose and mess it all up. This is such a good France. I don't want it to die. 
economy is doing great. Corporate businesses are doing great. And they're still building some. I love these people. Oh, yeah, I forgot about something real important. And Kapuya. <laughs> All right, I guess I'll run around and do this real quick. Um, but I don't really know what else to do. It's really just a matter of if I just care enough to just try to go for an all-out war and see if I win. Um, there's no guarantee for victory. That's kind of why I want to wait for gas attack, because it kind of gives me that middle ground where... Let's say I go to war and there's a bunch of people invading me from all sides. I have gas, so I just gas everything. And if there's a rebellion inside France, well, guess what? I have a bunch of gas and it will gas everything. It's really where the advantage lies at. And if somebody else researches it during the fighting, again, I would have the defense for it. I just hate when the AI puts focus on certain factories. I don't believe in this. I just believe it just like let it dilute out. Let the workers do their thing. They know what they're doing. Okay, we're in the S's. So we're West Sahara, and it is done. Alright, factories are building up. We hit 1900 and I'll end the episode. About that, that works. Alright. Gentlemen, head north. And go ahead and start building me the new army. We're going to build one more in preparation. And then we're going to liberate the uh, rest of Belgium. It's kind of why I puppeted them, because I, I kind of want to have a puppeted Belgium, give them the rest of Wallonia. Does anybody have claims here? No, the only person with a core is Luxembourg himself. Otherwise, I probably would have went after them too. We should try again. Excellent. Alright. So those infantry will be done soon. Three. Two. Eh. Two, three. Oh my god. I hate this game sometimes. Nope, that's the Corsica one. That's the one I said no on. Mains and try air. Good. So like I said, I'm very shocked at how much we have our cult. How much, um research we have we researched all the texts this fast like it's amazing so i'm kind of glad i dropped the other tech line because that tech line was so bad man it is it is a huge hamper on your ability to be able to do anything especially when you get a naval decrease under it i think russia still has it what was it again navy tech minus 25 a culture five percent boots industry down five percent like there is absolutely no reason to keep that 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 idea for your uh, for your uh, whatever how you call it your mission group like it's so bad that technology man it is horrible I I love the one I'm at right now everything works out fine I have everything I want there's nothing I got to worry about also where the hell is the Italian army. It has zero troops. What the hell is wrong with them? They're like completely broken. Well, actually, wait a minute. If I go to war with these guys and Britain joins Spain, a major, man, she's a secondary. Economy's still doing fantastic, though. I'm just gonna keep upgrading it. Just keep up in factories, man. That's all you can do. Subsidize them, let them go do their thing. Is there another, um, group? No, there's just these guys. Two per state, universal, first past the post, meetings allowed, all this is done. Any movements, campaign for old age security. I'd be happy to give them their old age security. Okay, let's go for military directionism. That army's done. You guys can actually head... I feel like I should send some of these guys down on the Spanish border. We only need three armies down there. That's doable. I say let's send the reinforcements near Osley Serene down there. And then... 
decrease our relations real quick. Alright, border with Spain's guarded. I shouldn't have to worry about it too much. You guys are going to head north. And then we're liberating Alonia. I want them back in Belgium sphere. Or not sphere, but I want them back under their control. Can I liberate? No, it doesn't really allow you to. Let's just kill them. Alright, oh yeah, I said I was going to end this episode, do one more for you guys. Um, so with that, please like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. We come back everybody, the, uh, the war for Wallonie. Wallonie. Oh, yeah, Wallonie. Let's try to secure back the territory Belgium lost. And with that, that will expand their powers, giving them back a little bit of their industry, resources, mainly their coal, their iron. And it should hopefully give them enough influence to be able to be a major power up in our northern region. And be a nice bulwark against the um, Germans. Because you know I'm going to be enforcing this line, which is going to be up to here, here. And I'm going to guard it all. That way my troops are off my border and are in the Belgian territory and I can fight a little bit better. Um, so as I said, do those things guys. And I will see you in the next round of Vicky 2's France. See you then. Thanks.